Hey, how are you? Well, today I'm going on an art installation and I'm hanging five paintings that are all the same size and they're going to hang five in a row. And the best way to do that is with a Z-bar. This works exactly like a French cleat system. It's just a much lower profile and you can find these on Amazon. So I've made a jig to help with the installation and right now I'll go downstairs, get the jig and any tools that I'll need for the project and then we'll head over to the job. The jig for the project is nothing more than a quarter inch piece of plywood that I've cut to eight inches wide. I'll attach this to the wall an inch and a half lower than where I want the tops of the paintings to be. Transfer lines from the jig to the wall and attach the Z-bar to those lines. I'll need to bring a level, a screw gun, a little painter's tape. It's better to put painter's tape on the wall than to put pencil marks all over the wall and a sharp pencil. All right, well that went really smooth, and it always does when I use the Z-Bar system, and that's why I use it. If I were to try to hang that installation on a wire, each painting be on a wire, uh, eventually some of the paintings would be crooked, and it would just ruin the whole installation. So uh, that's why I use a Z-Bar. Now I didn't talk during the installation because I really wanted to focus on getting the paintings on the wall nice and straight and level. And so one of the things I might not have been that clear about is once you attach the jig to the wall and trace your line, just make sure that you attach the Z-bar to the wall with the bottom of the Z-bar at that line. If you do that and your jig is level, you'll have a perfect installation every time. Now, um, the clients were really happy with the R and the installation, by the way, and they've been collecting my work now for years. They have a lot of, of my small paintings, and they do have one of my stars, too. It's an older star. It's really abstract. So I went around their house and photograph some of my art that's in their house which was cool and I'll um, I'll put an installation not an installation I'll put a slideshow up at the end of this video and if you're interested in my work you can find it on my website at the uh, shop John Peters or if you want to see bigger installations uh, or you know where I've done some really large work for uh, homes in New York City and on the Navasink River and out in the Hamptons uh, you can go to the portfolio section on my website and check those out. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you soon.